Was at the four hour, the eight, and obviously the end of the race. So they're back timing. The engineers are back timing. If you can extend your fuel run a little bit longer. Stra oh, look at that. Oh. Wow, yellow flag there. And uh, Colin Brown was trying to get out of the way of Richard Westbrook. And uh, the yin and the yang there nearly went totally wrong. Saw a yellow flag waving. I'm not sure what that was for. No. Actually, John Bennett, the team owner, shown in the 54 car right oh. now. Meanwhile, Oz Negri shakes his head as he sits in the pits in the number 60, Michael Shank Racing Liger. So let's see. Let's pick up what I this... I crashed hard. I crashed hard. Okay. Oh, he's not in the he's pits. He's not in the pits. I think he's no. in the tires. He's uh, in the tire wall for sure. Yeah. They've been adjusting on that car, and then they had that uh, other pit stop that Brian reported, and uh, well, they were looking for some issues, so... Oz is frustrated. There's been so much effort and resources poured into this Ligier chassis and making the switch. See the safety crew oh arriving boy. at the oh car. Boy. Oh, yeah. So I hit with a GT on the kink and uh, threw me over the curve and the car just spun. Is that yeah. the 1415, that fast section towards the back straight? Yeah, you can I think it is. Yeah, the, you can uh, see the accident track. started up here and he the ended Bishop. up here, so, you know. Bishop Ben, let's go on board and see if we can see what happened. Is a massive hit. Oh, I felt that. Oh. Huh. Brian I wonder Sellers, if Salazi was trying to tuck in the inside of the Falcon Porsche there and got on the curb big time and then hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was that was you know, that was one of those incidences that you you make that pass a hundred times in a race like this and and uh, you know Brian was just got it's very fast for him through there, the GTL cars, you know, they have to take their line. I mean they, you can give a bit of room, but that was very the, it almost spun, pivoted so fast on the curb as it got onto the under tray, probably, Kevin. The suspension went up, and uh, when he went in, I'm sure our viewers felt the violence through the steering wheel. Absolute violence. And he's shaken right now. He is, and one of the rules is you're supposed to stay in the car until the, basically the corner workers or the marshals get to you. So, And to give a shout-out to the corner workers you know, and the marshals, I... This morning in the dark, pre-dawn as we go, as we arrived, they were having their safety briefing just behind our.